The Eton Fire Department is soon to be no more. This decision to cut the department leaving firefighters and citizens concerned. News World's Nick Hill traveled to Murray County today and is live with reaction from the North Georgia community. Nick. Eton has 824 residents as of the 2020 census. These residents have been depending on the Eton Fire Department for emergency service. In the coming weeks, however, this will be changing. I am currently a part-time firefighter for the city of Eton, um, but after April 13th, that will no longer happen. A lack of communication has 10 part-time firefighters frustrated in Eton. So we're just trying to make the citizens aware of what's happening. Not only are 10 employees are losing their job, but also it affects the whole community of Eton. Eton Mayor Billy Cantrell has announced that Eton is entering an agreement with Murray County to provide fire services for the city. He was unavailable for comment today, but did issue us a statement. He says there are two primary issues that drive this decision, safety and economics. In regards to safety, he says that relying on part-time firefighters who many times worked one-man shifts might not be the safest option for citizens. He goes on to say that nearby county fire stations, in his opinion, provide equal or better response times. However, firefighters don't see it that way, as a house fire was ongoing this morning in northern Murray County that proved the potential drawbacks for Eton. If there was an incident in the city of Eton, the only other two options you have are stations one, which is on 225 South in Spring Place, or station two, which is on 0411 in Bramhurst. In terms of economics, Cantrell says that relying on the county fire department would keep the city's ISO rating at four and prevent taxes from being raised. He says that Eton is working on an agreement to move Advent Health EMS into the city's current fire department building. Shelley says this process began with the previous fire chief retiring and a new one has not been hired. Uh, why did the citizens not get input? Why were they not made aware? The citizens found out when we found out and then it's still very quiet, you know, he, He's not responding to anybody. We did also speak with a representative from Murray County. They did confirm that there is a temporary agreement for the county to cover Eton, but that is a longer term agreement is still being worked on. Contradicting Mayor Contrell's statement that there is a long term deal signed between the city and the county. Stanley and other firefighters are planning to protest the decision at next Tuesday's city council meeting at Eton City Hall. Reporting live, Nick Hill, News 12.